Hello students. Today we are previewing lesson 1.4.1. Welcome to year 1, week 4, lesson 1.4.1. Today we will work on your English vocabulary. So, the first thing I want you to do is watch the vocabulary video two or three times. And here is part of the video. You just click here. Hello students, this is Maestro Elvis. And uh, today we're going to focus on pre-kindergarten Dolch Sight Words Part 4 of 4 lesson. Hopefully you have already completed your pre-kindergarten Dolch Sight Words Part 3 of 4 quiz. Okay, so you watch this video several times, and then you read aloud the following words and sentences and in English, and then translate them, using the translator here, uh, into your primary language. Okay, so the words are, and repeat after me, see the three, two, two, up, we, where, yellow, and you. And then you read the sentences. Can you see the moon? Did you see the rainbow? I want to see Paris, France. Okay. So you read it in English. Remember, you've already um, heard this being read in English from the video. So this shouldn't be difficult. You read these sentences in English, and then you translate into your primary language if you don't understand, if you need to understand the meaning behind the sentences. Part three, uh, you fill in the blanks with the vocabulary words, and you can translate the text in your primary language to help you. So I suggest you get a sheet of paper or a notebook and you copy this down in your notebook. Then you put in the lines, the appropriate word from here. Okay, so you, that's your classwork. Just uh, uh, fill in. So the banana is C, the banana is the, the banana is three. You figure out what goes in this box over here. Okay, and finally, you take a quiz. Again, you'll need your own paper or notebook, uh, and you will do the quiz. So let's see here. Hello, students. This is Maestro Elvis. Have you studied your pre-kindergarten Dolch Sight Words Part 4 of 4 lesson? Are you ready for the pre-kindergarten Dolch Sight Words Part 4 of 4 quiz? All right, so you take the quiz here, and you work on that, okay? Finally, finally, let us know your quiz score in the comment section below. So you have the comment section. Hi, my name is, I am from. Today I scored 10 out of 10 on the quiz or 8 out of 10 on the quiz. That's what you can write. And then I'll respond to you and uh, Hopefully you do your best and you score really high on the quiz. If you don't do well the first time, you can take the quiz again. Not a problem until you score at least 8 out of 10 correct. Okay? So this was our vocabulary lesson. This was lesson 1.4.1. Please do your best and I hope uh, I uh, read some positive comments about how well you did on the quiz.